always fire it up before you put all the screws back because you do not want to take everything apart and test what you did. Okay, so I'm back at it again with this IBM ThinkPad. I finally got the new set of speakers from eBay. Um, if you recall, maybe a, if you don't recall, but in the previous video, I took apart this laptop and noticed that the speaker's wire was literally ripped off. So I went ahead and t took everything apart. This laptop required that I took take apart everything underneath, including the CPU cooler, because there are a couple little screws down here that I need to take off in order to take off the the bezel that goes over here. And um, when the speakers are plugged in, when, when I, I lay them out, I have to run the wire down this path right here and they connect all the way up here, which is kind of insane. You put the speakers up there and then you have to run the wires up here. And that's probably because I have, and then the headphones, where are the headphone jacks in this thing? Yeah, they're right here. So they probably run the, they had, they had the sound card is over here somewhere on the other side of the motherboard maybe. But yeah, it's it's a lot of work. Um, when I take apart the laptop, I start in the bottom and I if I flip the laptop over, um, this is the, the, the this is the layout of screws. That way I put them back exactly where they belong because there are different sizes as you can see. These are the screen and then um, these are the two little ones for the bezel and uh, you know I, I, I try to group them so that I, I put them back as, as, as clearly as possible. Um, on this side we got the CPU cooler, this guy, and I previously put some thermal paste on it. I'll, I'll have to like move that around again so that it's nice and smooth. Um, and the screen bezel. When you take these apart, you have to start by the inner part like this. Never start yanking the corners because you'll rip it apart. You start by the middle and you start pulling out. Um, what else? I got the, the top bezel. Always disconnect these, um, these ribbon cables first before you pull anything apart because you will break them. And getting just those is impossible, pretty much. Um, and uh, this is the bottom, the trackpad. Again, when you pull this apart, be very careful because these ribbon cables can rip off. Or this little guy right here. That's just a. Uh, I think that's just the uh, the light for the ThinkPad. Or these guys, these little lights too. And we got the hard drive. In this case, is a 160 gig SSD. The optical drive, which has a little screw that you must take off in order to slide out. And then the bottom cover over here. So yeah, uh, as soon as I get everything wired together, um, I'm going to put it back together and uh, give it a try. Okay, here's a power tip. Always, always power it up before you put all the screws back. Because you do not want to have to redo everything. So... Here it is, powered up, and the sound works again. And everything else works, the mouse, the keyboard works. So just make sure that everything is working as expected. These little guys, see, that works. Um, that's because we've messed around with all those ribbon cables. We, don't, we wanna make sure that everything here lights up, everything works. There's no battery, so. Um, cool, so now we can finish up. And here it is. The audio is working. Everything's back together, all the screws are in. I didn't have any extra screws, which is always a good sign. And uh, all the little lights and everything works. So, as you can hear, um, also the bottom, everything is put together. 
and that's it. Well, thanks for watching. I hope this was useful. Uh, remember, when taking these apart, be very careful. You don't want to rip apart any of those ribbon cables. If you're taking apart flexible plastic like this, you should always start by pulling this. And uh, and if you do everything carefully and lay out your screws in, a, in the same way that the case is laid out, then you should be able to do this easily. All right. So um, hope you enjoyed watching. Subscribe if you like this kind of stuff. I I do a lot of teardowns and repairs. And um, I'll, I'll see you soon. Bye.